Good afternoon, RHS. I'm Lauren. And I'm Garrett. And this is your Daily Dose for Monday, September 11th, 2023. Please use today, the anniversary of the attack on our country, as a day to remember how we came together after such a tragedy. Our country's best side came out during that time. Today, try to remember that being a, hu a good human is more important than all other things. Be kind to someone today to honor those who lost their lives on September 11th. Now, on to school news. All juniors and seniors interested in Potter Puff, this event will be held on Monday, September 18th. All players and cheerleaders participating must pay $25, which includes the game and a t-shirt. Players also need a mouth guard. They are $3. You must have a shirt, mouth guard, and permission slip to play. All forms are due to Miss Justice's room, A324, today. Are you interested in joining any clubs this year? National Art Honor Society is having an informational meeting on Thursday, September 14th at 3 to 4 p.m. in the art room. Be sure to go check it out. Also, Gamers Club is back. If you like to play video games, board games, card games, or Dungeons and Dragons, join Mr. Perry and Mr. Brown on Tuesdays and Thursdays from 3 to 4. The first meeting will be tomorrow, Tuesday, September 12th. Stop by room A178 to see what Gamers Club is all about. Quiz Bowl is another club you can join. It is an academic competition between area high schools with questions from all school subjects as well as music and pop culture. The, the RHS Quiz Bowl team is holding a short informational meeting on Thursday, September 14th in Mr. Curtis's room, B212 at 3 p.m. Come check out the team and learn more about the competitions. See Mr. Curtis if you have any questions. We also have two clubs here at RHS, Geoetics Travels to Other Countries and WAC Travels Within the U.S. WAC is a school exchange program. RHS partners with a high school in a different state and students travel and stay with the student there while also hosting that student in Wyandotte for the weekend. The WAC program schedules activities to explore for the trips. It is a fun opportunity to see what high school life is like outside of Michigan. See Miss Souls if you are interested in joining. If you are interested in traveling in Greek gods or walking in the steps of Roman emperors, what about experiencing the streets of Tokyo and marveling at the grandeur of Mount Fuji? Travel to Italy and Rome in March of 2024 or to Japan in 2025 with the RHS Geo Addicts. Who can be in Geo Addicts? Anyone. Open to all RHS students. These educational trips will give you memories that will last a lifetime. Fundraising opportunities and scholarships can help cover the cost of the trip. Consider joining us on this once-in-a-lifetime adventure. For additional information, please see Mr. Souls in A214. If you are unsure about which clubs are available, no worries. RHS will be hosting our second annual RHS Club Day during Spirit Week on Wednesday, September 20th, so you can browse and see all there is to get involved in. Now in sports news. Football beat Edsel Ford in the blackout cancer game, bringing their record to 2-1 on the season with a score of 35-7. Defensively, Thomas Villarreal led the team in tackles on the night. Offensively, Thomas Capicelli threw two touchdowns to Chase Klein in under five minutes. The team will take on Carlson at Carlson this Friday at 7 p.m. Also, this weekend, the volleyball team hosted a tournament here at RHS and Cross Country traveled to New Boston. We will have more information on that tomorrow. Today, the boys soccer team will take on the defending league champion Thunderbirds at Etzel Ford. Good luck, boys. Tomorrow at 4 p.m., our girls volleyball team will be at Lincoln Park. Our boys tennis team will be headed to Allen Park at the same time. That's all for sports. Now, a message from Officer Cole to anyone who rides a bike to school. Please make sure to lock it up before the school day starts to prevent them from getting stolen. Thank you. Homecoming and Spirit Week are next week. Homecoming court voting is taking place now. The first round of voting is happening today and tomorrow. Check your email for the ballot. The next round will be Wednesday and Thursday. Be sure you are checking your email so you don't miss out on voting. The homecoming dance will be held on Saturday, September 23rd. Tickets are on sale only this year. Go to GoFan to purchase your ticket. Also, homecoming shirts are this month's flavor of the month through Wyandotte Tees. They can be ordered online until Thursday. Go to accenttees.com slash flavor of the month to order yours now. Now that's all for today. RHS, have, have a great, great day. day.